Okay, hello guys, what is up? Uh, we're here with another snapshot video with Dan. Uh, hello. You haven't, you haven't, we haven't been to talk to you in a long time. How, how's life? How's life? It's like one video. It's actually been more oh. than one video. But anyway. Yeah, uh, <laughs> anyway. I'll count them. Okay, um. Oh god, this might take a while. Yeah, um, I thought I'll let you know the server side bugs and the SMP bugs before we even start. Uh, the server side bugs, chests don't actually have an open animation. So look, if you look there. Four! They don't have an open or close animation. This was four. Yeah, and uh, if I go into a uh, single player So if I go into a single player world, it has an open and close animation. So yeah, interesting. What? So anyway, uh, as well as that's the... Anyway, the uh, single multiplayer bug uh, at A does not actually work for command blocks. I would have done this, but unfortunately it just didn't work when I was in a single player world and also it didn't work when I was in multiplayer, so I had to do it on P. But those are the bugs that, that I've noticed. If you've got any more bugs, put them in the comment section below. And shares like that. Anyway, we'll ignore that for now. It says uh, we'll go on to the new block, so let's do that. Read the book in Quill. And it's Anvil and Stump Stoof. So it says, read me, and it says, grab the two items in the supply chest. One anvil, one oak saplings. Name the oak sapling Jerry. Right click the chest that's right next, to the, uh, the right next to you and see the next blocks. So if you do that, oh, that's, that's oak nice. sapling, Jerry, put it in your hand, Is and then try and bearing? look, if you do, See, this chest is actually locked, so if you right click it, it says this chest is locked. If you right click it with the sapling, that says Jerry. It doesn't actually have to be a sapling, it can be- Really? I found a way to get in. Eh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. I Yeah, <laughs> <Don't>. <laughs> Okay, so anyway, um, apart from getting that, it could be anything- Really? Anyway, um, so it could be anything from uh, uh, from an oak sapling to like anything. It could even be a fucking leaf block or anything. Really? You d Never mind. So I'll have, to, I'll have to explain the new blocks because he just deleted them all. Okay guys, we're on my single player world that I created this and nothing really else because like um, I moved it to multiplayer. So let's just put it to time set zero. And uh, what I did was I had to ditch rival because he kind of deleted this. But yeah, this is the chest is locked. And there you go, you got a uh, locked chest. If you want to know how, I'll go through that in a minute. But you got the granite, the polished granite, the dorite, the polished dorite, the anasite, and the polished anasite. And we got the slime block. Now I can, I'll tell you in about five minutes. I will we'll swap onto this uh, server one, and we'll tell you how to make the polished and the slime block. But if you want to know how to make the lock chest, here it is. You can go and stop and uh, look at it, or you can go in the so uh, you can go in the description and find out. Uh, I'm just gonna go put that in there, and uh, yeah, delete it because it's pointless. Yeah, coincidence. I'll right on top of the chest. Okay, what? I'm sorry. <laughs> do you do? You don't need to be sorry. Stop it. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, thank you. What is wrong with you, Rob? Never mind. Anyway, um, we go on to the recipes now. So the recipes are for full polished granite. You get four per one, and that is just like a little. So you can do it in your survival and uh, crafting, and that is uh, like that and like that and like that. And you get four of them for uh, every four, so it, it kind of evens it out. And then if you want to sl a slime block, you have to have a nine by nine. I've tried a four by four, it didn't work. So nine by nine makes you a slime block. And if you really want uh, the mossy stone brick, is now available for uh, crafting. All you have to do is uh, get vines and put them right next to stone brick, and you get a mossy stone brick. So yeah. Okay. Uh, if you want to know how to get granite or anything like that, they're actually spawned anywhere. So if you go over here, so for example, if I look down a bit, uh, I there you go, anasite. I was about to show you. I found anasite right there. Um. um Tell there's a fucking. There's more. Uh, oh, there's dorite. And yeah, there's some redstone. Okay. Anyway, the next one is the um, the enchantment table. Now they've improved the enchantment table quite a bit, and my resource pack is not kind of supported. So I'll hop into normal tech. I'll hop into normal resource pack. So we'll okay, we are in the normal resource pack, and uh, if you right click on the enchantment table. It actually gives you a weird block and a thing, and then there you go. So, if I hop into my ender chest, 
Oh my god. So, um, you got the bottles of enchanting, the diamond stoof, uh, bow, and lapis lazuli. Now, we're gonna hop into, uh, survival real quick. There you are. And then, uh, what you gotta do is you gotta put the item in this slot. Now, it says a level requirement 2, so we're gonna bump ourselves up to 2 real quick. Let's just bump ourselves up to at least about 7, 8, probably 9. There you go, 10. That'll do. So pop it in there, and then it still says it requires one lapis lazuli, but it says sharpness I dot dot dot. And then that says knockback. I don't know why. So yeah, and that, uh, the reason why it needs lapis lazuli, now you need to enchant with lapis. So that's a lot more better. So I'm going to enchant it with sharpness. There you go, you, you now get sharpness, uh, projectile protection, but you can also have an extra enchantment. It tells you what half of it is. So projectile protection, that's that's oh protection, that's normal. Protection, see look, protection and unbreaking. Uh, protection. Protection. I can't do the hoe, which is annoying. Giggity. Uh, unbreaking, and that's still unbreaking. So there you go. I, um, I don't get that joke. So yeah, there it is. Um, and that actually had knockback one. I, 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 and it came with snipe and knockback. So yeah, you could get anything you want. So let's just put all those in there. Do you want some of them, rival? Because I know you wanted some. Um, of what? Uh, lapis and fucking enchantment bottles. Um, I've noticed you can't use a lapis block. It's yeah, you can't use the lapis block. You have to use lapis pieces. So yeah, let's hop into creative real quick. Reese's pieces. Okay, now we uh, fix the experience bar for creative mode. So instead of like, uh, like anvilling something together in creative, uh, you just like get the actual experience points. They've actually fixed it now, so um, it just says one. <laughs> so let me just put a. Let's just say no. I don't need them to. Uh, let's just say an iron sword. Uh, I need it with an iron sword that's been enchanted by, say, like power. So, uh, oh, well, I just got a good weapon though. So, so that bane of alpha pause. Let's just say that. Okay, Bye. so um, say like that, and then that, and then look. Oh, it says yeah, it says enchantment level two. Now, they've uh, bumped it down for creative mode, so uh, you don't actually see the actual right experience. So yeah, it's actually quite good. Uh, yeah. So the next one is actually they've added new commands, and the new commands are the entity selectors command, the block data command, the slash killing command blocks, which is finally, and the you can destroy for game O2 command. So let's have a look at the entity selectors. All of the commands will be in the description below. So the entity selectors is what? Oh yeah, I need to be in survival. I'm an idiot sometimes. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Get out of the way. There you are. Okay, out the way. Out the way. Alright, there you go. Okay. Just do that. Uh, right, entity selectors in CMD. And what you need to do is you need the added entity selectors use slash uh, as E in certain commands to target entities that you can limit with. So type chicken or type skeleton. So yeah, feel free to use that at any time. Now you got the block data command. Uh, oh. Did you take it? Nope. Oh, there it is. Um, so the block data command, uh, you've got, they've added a block data command, and the block data command is, uh, the, this is the example, so you've got slash block data, the x and the y and the z coordinates, and then you've got the data tag. I have no idea what this means, uh, feel free to put in the comment section below what it means. Now you've got the slash kill in the command blocks, which is pretty damn good. Uh, like that one. Yes. Uh, they've added an optional parameter to slash kill, so you can do slash kill, at e, player, a. Ow, like what that. the fuck? That's how it's, is that how it works? Meh, can't hear you. And the next one is the can destroy for game mode 2 command. Okay, now what these do is you can do slash, uh, this is the example. So you can do uh, slash give at p, minecraft iron pickaxe, one, zero, can destroy, minecraft, comma, comma, stone. So let's do that right now. I've actually got it on a sticky note, so let me just go grab it real quick. Instead it says bedrock. I don't even know what I was trying there. So let me just go change that real quick. Alright, it is done. So so let me just type this in the chat. There you go. And then I've received an iron pickaxe that says can destroy, can break, uh, tile, stone, name. So that, that makes no sense, but still. Uh, so if I hop into game mode uh, 2. So I can't really destroy 
that's kind of bugged up, but all right. I think it's any stone, so I think this is class of stone, so <laughs> whatever. Uh, so oh, yeah, you can only great. destroy stone and things that are like stone. So, so granite are, is like stone. Coal is not like stone, but stone is stone. But if you try to put down a uh, cobblestone, so put that down, please. Well, I'll go get rid of the weather. All right, thank you. That's enough. Anyway, uh, so yeah, I try to do it and it won't allow me to do it. And if you notice, if you hold, if you don't hold any item, you got the uh, hitbox. If you hold an item, you don't get the hitbox. So that's actually quite clever. So that is the tweaks I've done in game. Okay, and uh, now we're back on the normal resource pack. I've got an enchanted book. Oh wait, are you on the normal or yours? Mine. Uh, oh. So yeah, now in uh, game mode, so you can now middle click and it'll give you 60 instead of 64. So I don't know if that's a glitch or anything, but yeah. So um, if you right click, it gave me one for some reason. What? What? It's no longer. It's working. What happened? Uh, what, hap no. what happened to? Uh, it's, it's, I don't know if this is a single player bug or something, but what happened to single player? Uh, okay, I don't know what that. I don't know what that yeah. was. I, Shove. I don't know what that was. Uh, I, I we can now delete that son of a bitch. Anyway, um, so that pretend that wasn't there. Anyway, um, here's the uh, like server side thing. So if you do click here, it says and some service stuff like cross bucket and stuff. So I'll show you what I mean in about five minutes. Like now, uh, if I hop over to Wolfcraft. It says craft bucket 1.7.2. So that's actually quite clever. You can now know if someone's is using craft bucket. Nice. So anyway, as well as that, uh, well, if you notice, if you put down slime blocks, like if I hear, it puts like a, st it, 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 it's a stone sound. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Now you wanted to explain something here, rival? Okay. Well, basically, if you walk over slime, it slows you down. But if you put a carpet on it, like this over here, you won't be slowed down. And slime has bouncing properties. So if you bounce on it, you go higher, then lower, then lower, then lower, then lower, then lower, then lower, then lower. Then lower. And that's basically it. Okay. <laughs> so anyway, uh, it looks like Ravel's built a... I built us two thingies. I built us a trampoline with diving boards. Yay! You know what? I want to go check if any mobs will go down. Uh, let me go try a zombie and a horse because you know YOLO. Oh, they do bounce, huh? What about a horse though? The, the non-hostile. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you want to get down. Oh, he does. That's pretty cool. So I know what to do. Bounce faster. A bounty castle party. Alright guys, I hope you did enjoy this episode. My name has been Wasted. Remember, if you did like this episode, slide that like button with your cat, so on and so forth. I hope you see you in the next episode. Take care. Bye. Bye. Bye.